going on? Everybody, welcome back today, guys, to the channel Forza Horizon 5. We're back today in beautiful Mexico City, and uh, we're here today to look at the brand new car pass vehicle, which is the ultra rare Ferrari J50. Now, if you guys have not heard of the J50 before, like myself, I actually had to look this thing up. Uh, this is a part of uh, Japan's 50th anniversary, and they only made 10 of them. This thing is extremely rare. We have it today for free with the car pass. And uh, this seems like it's gonna be a pretty nice ride for today's episode. We're gonna see what we can do with it. Yes, they've added some new things here. And for Oh, we get the Christmas tree too. We're in the Christmas market, I think. I didn't actually see this with the new update, man. We have a lot of things to take a look at. If you guys missed yesterday's episode, we were on Drift 21 taking a look at the brand new 8.6. Um, unfortunately, I did not get it in Forza Horizon 5. I know there was so many people saying, Slap, just do the festival playlist. I didn't do it. I said, no, man. I'm going to go ahead and uh, try to win the damn thing. I know it's going to be a little bit harder, but um, I think if I do it right, maybe I can get it, right? I just hold my fingers a little bit to the left, cross them up. Across the toes, same time, maybe it'll just appear in the wheel spin. I don't know, hopefully. Uh, we'll have to wait and see for next wheel spin episode. Huge thanks for coming around for today. Let's go ahead and take a look at the brand new J50. Let me know your thoughts down below on the car pass cars. And uh, we need to take a look at the video game awards as well, too. There's a lot of people asking my thoughts on them. I haven't even seen the winners. Oh, and uh, see who ended up winning. And I'm going to give my thoughts real time on some of these game winners. Um, I really don't know. I've heard. Some good and bad things. I don't know. We'll have to see. Huge thanks for watching for today. Forza Horizon 5. And of course, don't forget to slap that like button. So first off, we got to get over to the car pass. We also got to go check out the hockey rink as well, too. That's something I wanted to do. 681 horsepower on this thing. J50 2017. Man, I didn't even know this thing existed, to be completely honest. I thought it was a brand new car. So this car is basically based off of the uh, 488. If I'm not mistaken, and it looks clean. Man, look at the carbon fiber on this thing. Oh, 3.9 liter twin turbo V8 on this thing, pushing well over 600 horsepower. Oh, I wish we could walk around in this game actually outside, man. That'd be so cool. Look at this wheel. This is the nicest wheel I've ever seen. Black on black with the gold stitching. Ooh, I like that a lot. Okay. Oh, man, look at the seats. Looks like something out of a spaceship, to be honest with you. Okay. And something out of a spaceship, uh, Thrustmaster Hotas system is in Lost in Space. Actually, their controls for the chariot, which is their truck that they drive around. And it's also the controls for their ship, which I thought was really cool to see. Right, Thrustmaster's working hand in hand with Netflix, supplying them the best of the best. I'm not going to throw on anything other than wheels. I just want to change up the wheels here. Oh, we could run with the work VSXXs, man. Let's run them. I remember, uh, this would definitely not... Uh, be a manual transmission car, right? We got the full six speed with the uh, gear shifter here. Look at all the Christmas decorations. Oh my God, the turbos, I can hear them. <laughs> they sound mean, one more time. Why is he shifting with his left hand? Can you do that in these things? Seventh gear coming downhill. Could be dangerous. We're going to go back down to six, though. Oh, bad idea, house! We're drifting the J50 out here. I didn't think I'd see it. Roll for a big entry. Can we do it? Oh! Of course, today we got our Thrustmaster TSXW out. We got to up our wheel rotation right quick. I thought I was on... I thought I was on the highest one, but there we go. Back to 900, and look at this. Oh, my God. I'm glad I picked blue. I'm a Maple Leafs fan out here. Love watching hockey. And we put a... Yeah, I put a... Could have, would have put a... Had these snow tires on here. At least this is a nice. We can kind of have a look at this and then come back with our snow tire build, but... Vicious, though, man. They're like, no, no. You need snow tires, which I get. right? I understand it. Hit this jump, maybe? Ooh! That was perfect. Oh, boy. Yeah, we really do need those snow tires. No, this way. Yeah. Oh, they knocked the tree right over. That's cool. Yeah, they definitely put a lot of effort into this update. I'm a huge fan of what they did here with the hockey arena. 
and I kind of like what they did, right? They called it a hockey pitch. I get it now. We have the nets from soccer, and we're using a hockey rink. How cool is that, man? Let's go ahead and drift it in here if we can. We'll go fourth gear with it, I think. Ooh, we're here. Now, right, where is the puck? Who's brought the puck? It's got to be over here, no? We're actually getting sideways in this thing. Yeah, we're going to put myself in the net. Big tendy. <laughs> the net does not move. Where is the net physics right now? This is disappointing. <laughs> I need net physics. How are we supposed to play hockey with no net physics? Can't roof it on the damn bottle? Well, we're going to try a quick old roundabout challenge here with this thing. I think it's just going to more or less grip up than anything, but... Oh, could be wrong. Look at this thing, it just points right in. We're holding six gear around this whole thing. And not for long though, let's go ahead and make that jump. You see it? I do. I'm going right over the side. I'm doing it. Hey! Oh, we went through it. Okay, I didn't think that was going to happen. Second sign, let's go. Go ahead, send this off the cliff one more time. And I'm going to have a quick look at the video game awards here. And let's have a see at uh, who took home the best of the best here for this week. All right, one last hill bomb. Uh, we're going to take a look at the Video Game Award winners. Coming through. Okay, Video Game Awards here. Game of the Year. It Takes Two got Game of the Year? Damn, I've played that actually. Right, I mean, me and the wife were playing that. We got quite a bit into that, and it was a good game. It was actually a lot of fun. However, Game of the Year, though, that's that's quite the, uh, holy jeez. Forza Horizon 5's not even the nominations? What the heck? <laughs> Returnal, maybe I need to. Forza Horizon 5 got audio design winner. Let's go. It says innovation and accessibility. Forza Horizon 5 won that one. They have some really cool accessibility features. If you guys have not already seen how to slow down your car, slow down the time, um, really cool stuff out there. Let's go back here while we're looking at the rest of these, and I'd like to do a little bit of upgrades on this J50, and let's see if we can get it a little bit more sideways, because it wants to drift. But we're gonna need some snow tires on this if we're gonna get on the ring. So yeah, um, I don't know. Not a lot of big games I felt like on there. Yeah, it's it's pretty crazy. Um, the winners of that though, I was not expecting any of those games on that list. I guess I mean I didn't play them, right? So it's so it's easy for me to say that. But if you guys played any of them and you think that they deserve those spots that they did, let me know in the comment section down below what you thought of the game of the year awards. And Ooh, let's go. It's actually surprisingly fun. I didn't think this was actually going to slide, but now with the addition of these tires this year, it does make really any car driftable, I feel like. Look at this! Oh boy, oh boy. Oh, I don't know about these snow tires. How do you guys feel about them? Do you feel like you want snow tires or drift tires or stock tires? I feel like I'm a, I feel like I'm a drift tire guy. Finally getting some speed with these though. It kind of makes it actually a lot more controllable. Woo! Okay. Oh no, oh no. Yeah, yeah. It's actually a nice solo section here that we've made. Treat! Oh! Bit of brakes. No! I needed to stay in that! What is this here for? Just go off the cliff? What the? Oh! Damn! Okay. Ooh. We do also have a big weekend in F1. Final race of the season. I'm going to crown a champion here. I don't know who you guys have, but... Man, I hope it's Max Verstappen, though. I really do. Let me know your thoughts down below on who you have going into the championship. It hasn't happened like this since 1974, man. That's crazy. Two drivers going into the championship at the exact same points kind of thing. Oh, big jump trips. And we didn't even hit the gifts. Let's go through the candy cane. Woo. This is driftable. We can drift this whole thing guaranteed now, I feel like. Let's do it. And we even got the bank on here, too. Like, look at this. It's J50 though. Obviously, we got you know the advantage of having the bank, but ooh, no, this is better than the outside one. Hold on, now let me get in there. I'm gonna turn this big old boat around. We got two guys doing it already. Straight to six. Oh, thank you. Thought my mirror was coming around there for sure. No, 
no, no. Oh, <laughs> Make sure you don't ride it right into the damn off ramp section. How you doing? <laughs> Coming full sideways around this man. Where is he? Oh boy. It's a handful though. You gotta make sure you're not fully on throttle. If you are, you're gonna find yourself rubbing out on the wall. Hey, okay, let's get into uh, a little bit of a better view, I think. This guy changed his name and everything, man. He was super excited for it, right? I'm just kidding. How do we play? Two collisions, that's a good one to have. We have 226 points, right? Why not? And we get an instant wheel spin. Here we go. 8-6, 8-6. Come on, please, man. 8-6. If you guys would like to see another wheel spin episode, let me know. Oh, man. 45 grand. Thank you. Tune on this thing, because we're going to need some of this rear tire pressure gone. It is just ridiculous right now. So let's also go ahead and bring up the speed. Yeah, we'll bring in this rear end just a little bit. Differential. It's feeling good, but I just feel like I want a little bit more on that rear end. We're gonna give this a shot here. Okay, let's not try to damage this thing going up. Would be nice. Is that one clean run? With our new J50, it's gonna take a little bit of patience because obviously, with the fact of uh, having the snow tires, this thing is all over the road. So be ready to put your foot back on it and uh, start to let it catch back up. That rear engine, just a lot of weights back there. Mid-engine, sorry, I guess you could say. Ooh. Oh, it's way too... Yeah, I thought it was going to be a little bit faster coming in. That is a no-go. Okay, we got our skills boost going on right now, too, because our song... We got our drift score going up. Hopefully we can pull our one of our best runs out here with our... Oh, oh, oh. What do they call this thing? The EcoBoost? V12 or something like that? Forgot what the hell this damn engine was called. Oh, no, 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 no. Custom. Back to tires. And I'm putting the drift tires on. They're just... They feel way better. Oh, yeah, it's a V12 hybrid. That's what we have in this thing. Okay, let's see what we can do with this thing. We're going to do a little freestyle challenge. See how these uh, drift tires compare. I think it's going to be a hell of a lot better. Oh, we're drifting right over this plane. We're doing it. Oh, that's sick. I just kind of thought of that. I was like, we have no drift events for the career mode here. We're going to actually test this thing in the Riviera Sprint Race. I don't think we're going to do very well, but you never know. Already in last place. No. Almost in last place. But we do have quite a bit of power, though, so I'm not too worried about it. Ooh. There's nothing better than trying to dodge some cars with a drift car out here. Here we go, here we go. Surprisingly holding nicely, as long as you're easy on the throttle. Oh, right as I say that. Jeez. I will punish you so quick. I will throw my tune on this thing if you guys are looking to uh, maybe drive this around, drift it around, you know, whatever you want to do. Definitely more set up for the higher end gears. Let's see if we can catch up. No, no. Choo, what? Okay. We're getting passed up hard. Jeez, man. What the hell was that? There you go. Oh! Crazy, man. We just wheelie. RJ. Let's see if we just catch this man's here. Oh, it's a sprint race. I didn't even realize that shit. Damn. Come on. Let's see if we can somehow thread the needle here, maybe. Ooh, and I also have a lot of custom events that I want to take a look at as well, too. A lot of things still left to do on Forza Horizon 5. Uh, I think the convoys are now fixed and working here, so we're going to be doing some open lobbies very soon, so make sure you guys check on Twitter for that. I still have yet to give away that damn key on the hot rod as well, too. I said I was going to do that. I'm going to do that tomorrow, so mark my words on that one here. Hit me up if I don't. Sunday. Be fun day, man. F1 fun day. 
Right again. No. Huh. Who said it was a great idea to bring the J50 in here, right? I don't I don't think it was me. It definitely was not me, because I would not have said that, again, right? We're in last place out here, right? Somebody said drift tires were the fastest tires out here, right? I I yeah. I like this car more than I did, actually. I, I didn't think I was gonna like this a lot, to be honest, but I think after driving it, I'm a fan of the J50, man. Let me know your thoughts down below. Huge thank you for watching for today. I'll see you guys back here tomorrow on the channel. I'm out. Peace.